Welcome back to Tokyo, where the world's best judokas are competing in the final event of the year. In a prestigious showcase of judo, where every match counts, who will rise to the occasion? In the under 100 kilo category, Kanikovsky started the finals off in top form and threw big for Ippon, claiming Tokyo gold and his third Grand Slam title of the year. Awarding the medals was IJF head referee director, Mr. Florin Daniel Lascao. Fan favorite Uta Abe ended the under 52 kilo final in the first minute with Ippon, delighting the local crowd. IGF ambassador, Her Imperial Highness Princess Tomohito of Mikasa, awarded the medals. When speaking to the press after her victory, Abe explained her motivations, delighting in her win on home soil, and said she was looking to improve her skills. She added that winning at home was important for her in order to showcase true Japanese judo to the world at one of the only international sporting events held in her country. Next up, her brother, Hifumi Abe, not to be outdone by his sister, he came up with another decisive ippon to ensure the siblings rule Tokyo. Mongolia Judo Association President, His Excellency Mr. Batulga Khaltma, awarded the medals. In an interview, the elder Abe sibling explained he felt proud of his form and technique during the competition. At under 78 kilos, Mayra Aguiar scored Wazaari for her first Tokyo gold medal. Awarding the hardware was IJF Ambassador Dr. Antonio Castro. At under 60 kilos, Nagayama bested Olympic champion Takato for the top spot, with IJF honorary member Mr. Nobuyuki Sato awarding the medals. Niku Takaichi held her way to Tokyo glory for the under 63s to the joys of her fans, with IJF EC member and Kodokan president Mr. Haruki Uemura on hand to award the medals. World champion Tsunoda forced Figueroa into a submission for her second gold in Tokyo. All Japan Judo Federation Senior Managing Director Mr. Soya Nakazato awarded the medals. At over 100 kilos, Bashaev ended the Grand Slam with a huge ippon, a treat for the fans. Awarding the medals was IGF Head Referee Director Mr. Armen Bagdasarov. There were ippons aplenty from the host athletes, as always in Tokyo, and Japanese legends Arai and Ono took to the tatami against some of their toughest opponents yet. An inspiring moment for kids across the world. Fans were overjoyed at the incredible judo today, and that's a wrap for another Tokyo Grand Slam and another incredible year of the World Judo Tour. Join us again next year.